the Emerald Dragon's Egg in the Kingdom of Eldoria, nestled between towering mountains and lush valleys. There lived a young adventurer named Luca. Luca dreamed of one day embarking on a quest to discover the greatest treasure in the realm, the legendary Emerald Dragon's Egg. For centuries, the Emerald Dragon's Egg had been sought after by brave souls and treasure hunters alike. It was said that whoever possessed the egg would gain unimaginable power and wisdom. Determined to prove himself as a true hero, Luca set out on a quest to find the elusive egg. Armed with his trusty sword and a heart full of courage, he journeyed across the kingdom, facing danger at every turn along the way. Luca encountered fellow adventurers and wise mentors who guided him on his quest. Together, they traversed treacherous forests, crossed raging rivers, and scaled towering peaks in search of clues that would lead them to the egg. After many trials and tribulations, Luca finally reached the lair of the Emerald Dragon, a vast cavern, hidden deep within the heart of the mountains. Inside the cavern, he discovered a shimmering nest cradling a single, glowing egg, the legendary Emerald Dragon's Egg. But as Luca reached out to claim the egg, he was confronted by the fearsome Emerald Dragon itself, a creature of immense size and power, its scales glistening in the dim light of the cavern. With bravery in his heart, Luca faced the dragon determined to prove himself worthy of the egg. And as he spoke of his quest and his desire to use the egg's power for good, the dragon's gaze softened and its demeanor changed, realizing that Luca possessed the courage and compassion needed to wield the egg's power responsibly. The emerald dragon bestowed upon him its blessing. With a gentle breath, it entrusted the egg to Luca, knowing that he would use its power to protect the kingdom and all who dwelled within it. And so, with the emerald dragon's egg in his possession, Luca returned to Eldoria as a true hero, hailed by the people as a champion of justice and peace. And though the egg's power was great, Luca knew that the true treasure lay not in its magic, but in the bonds of friendship and the strength of the human spirit. The Secret of the Enchanted Mirror and the Kingdom of Mistwood Nestled among towering forests and shimmering lakes, there lived a young girl named Isabel. Isabel was known for her kind heart an adventurous spirit, always seeking out new wonders in the world around her. One day, while exploring the ancient ruins deep within the heart of the forest, Isabel stumbled upon a hidden chamber concealed behind a veil of ivy. Inside the chamber, she discovered a magnificent mirror, an artifact of ancient magic that held the key to unlocking. Untold secrets, intrigued by the mirror's shimmering surface. Isabel reached out to touch it, and as her fingers made contact, she felt a strange sensation wash over her, with a sense of wonder. She realized that the mirror was no ordinary looking glass, it was a portal to another realm, where dreams and reality intertwined. Determined to uncover the mirror's secrets, Isabel embarked on a quest to unravel the mystery of its origins. With the help of her loyal companion, a playful fox named Jasper, she journeyed across the kingdom, facing trials and challenges along the way. 
As they traveled, Isabel and Jasper encountered a variety of characters, from wise old wizards to mischievous forest spirits. Each encounter brought them closer to uncovering the truth behind the enchanted mirror and the magic it contained. Finally, after many days of travel, Isabel and Jasper reached the heart of the forest where the mirror's creator awaited them. With a gentle touch, the creator revealed the mirror's true purpose. It was a gateway to the realm of dreams where hopes and fears took on tangible form. Realizing the importance of the mirror's magic, Isabel vowed to protect it from those who would seek to abuse its power. With the creator's blessing, she became the guardian of the enchanted mirror, using its magic to bring joy and wonder to the world around her. And as Isabel stood before the mirror, Surrounded by the beauty of the forest and the love of her friends, she knew that she had found her true calling to be a beacon of light in a world filled with darkness and to use her gifts to spread happiness wherever she went. The Tale of the Moonlight Guardian in the Land of Silver Mist where the moon cast its gentle glow upon the rolling hills and sparkling rivers. There lived a young girl named Luna. Luna was known throughout the kingdom for her kindness and bravery, as well as her deep connection to the mystical forces of the night. One evening, as Luna wandered through the enchanted forest that bordered the kingdom, she stumbled upon a hidden glade bathed in silvery moonlight. At the center of the glade stood a magnificent statue of figure cloaked in starlight and bearing a staff adorned with glowing crystals. Intrigued by the statue's beauty, Luna approached it with wonder. As she drew closer, she felt a strange energy coursing through her veins as if the statue were calling out to her with a silent plea for help. With a sense of determination, Luna reached out to touch the statue, and as her fingers made contact with the cool stone, she felt a surge of power wash over her. With a blinding flash of light, she was enveloped in a shimmering aura of moonlight and she knew in that moment that she had been chosen to be the Moonlight Guardian, a protector of the night and all its wonders. Emboldened by her newfound powers, Luna set out on a quest to defend the kingdom from the forces of darkness that threatened to engulf it. With the guidance of the ancient spirits of the forest and the wisdom of the moon itself, she faced challenges and adversaries with courage and grace. In the darkest hour, when the forces of darkness seemed unstoppable, Luna faced her greatest challenge, yet a malevolent sorcerer, who sought to plunge the kingdom into eternal night. With the power of the moon at her command, Luna confronted the sorcerer in a battle that shook the very foundations of the earth. In the end, it was Luna's bravery and compassion that prevailed. With a final burst of moonlight, she banished the sorcerer's darkness and restored light to the kingdom once more. And as the sun rose on a new day, Luna stood as a symbol of hope and resilience, a true guardian of the night.